throughout the Sino-Japanese dispute, my government has always kept in mind not only the rights and interests of China, but also those of other members. The present conflict has now reached a stage where it is more than a dispute between China and Japan. It has become a public issue for the whole world. It's the greatest danger to the League at the present moment is that under one pretext or another, and in its anxiety to seek a solution, it may compromise the great principles which it was founded to maintain. Furthermore, it is an open secret that the prestige of the League has suffered a great setback during the past few months. It is the earnest hope of my government that through the convocation of the Assembly, the League may yet recover some of its lost authority and dignity. I wish at this Assembly to declare most clearly the attitude of the Japanese government in the Shanghai affair. It is this. The Japanese forces are prepared to cease hostilities immediately. According as the situation in the Shanghai area becomes pacified, the Japanese expeditionary forces will be withdrawn from Chinese territory. The Japanese government has no intention whatever to promote any political or territorial ambition in the Shanghai region, availing itself of the present situation. We have no desire to establish a Japanese settlement in Shanghai or in any other way to advance the exclusive interests of the Japanese.